for today I'm going to be looking at what you should research with your research points. Alright, so the first thing that you're going to want to get is the bigger victory card packs. Just the value they get from every different value, like every card pack individually is just so good when you upgrade this because you're just getting so much more value you get so many more cards it just feels so much better i feel like i've been getting more legendaries more rares uh more in commas just with this card pack and i feel like the value i've gotten from it is insane especially for free to play players all right y'all so the second thing you want to get is the extra keys three out of three you might want to interchange this with that bigger victory card pack just because when you're playing a lot you want to have the ability to use those keys as you're playing as you're getting those victories and you don't want to really run out of keys so you want to play 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 use all your keys and then if you're a free-to-play player you want to chill out for a bit or you can keep playing too that's totally epically fine but you want to be able to play through all of your keys with uh and you want to have that ability to just keep playing and six this is allowing for six victories uh six card packs you're going to be able to get and that is huge for the program next thing that you want to get is login bonuses and we're going to bring this all the way up to five out of five next is going to be the lucky roulette again i feel like you can get so much value from the lucky roulette and all these things you'll be noticing is trying to get the most value you come back into your game on a daily basis you get tons of jobs through the lucky roulette through the daily challenge and oh my gosh you're going to be set to buying packs and you're just going to be able to do so much more the more gems you get the better off you are in getting leveled up in this game it's just going to be great for you the fifth thing is going to be more card requests. We're going to bring this all the way up to three out of three. That way we can request as many cards as possible in your clan. This is huge. You can upgrade the stuff you want to upgrade. And it's just really good because we're able to upgrade things now that we want to be able to upgrade. Now here, next thing we're going to want to get is the quicker key refill. We're going to want to go five out of five on this one. 90 minute refills, that's huge. You're going to be able to use all of your keys and get back up to full six keys super fast if you get this next tier for your fast keys. It's a great upgrade. Next, I recommend getting the greater gold rewards after each match. Ten, 10 gold after each match. Each victory, I should say, is pretty low. So when we upgrade to 30 and then to 45 then to 60, that is huge for the program. You're going to be getting so much gold from that. And you're going to really see the difference up in your gold bar. The last thing you're going to want to upgrade is the greater card donation rewards. So when you get three out of three, you're going to be getting so many rewards from donating to all of your clan mates. And they're going to be happy when you donate. And you're going to be happy back because you know you're getting all those rewards back when you donate. I do just want to say there's an honorable mention in this list, and that's Dakar Alchemist. If you have a bunch of le legendaries that you stock up, you can easily just switch out, redo this by clicking this little button here, re resetting your research points for 100 rubies. That's pretty low if you think about it. You're going to be getting those daily rewards if you get those login bonuses of rubies. And it's going to be pretty easy to do this because once you get those login bonuses, oh my gosh, 100 gems, that's like maybe a week. Okay, that's like that's not very long. And listen, if you really need this card alchemist, you need those six points, you just reset your reset your <clears throat> research points. Maybe get rid of the greater card donation rewards or one of the above. You don't really feel like it's working for you. And then you can get right into that and start alchemisting away, maybe. Also, I just want to say one last thing. The greater quest rewards. I don't really do the quest, but if you're someone who does the quest, this might be one thing to deviate away from my guide that I've just now created. Uh, greater Quest Rewards, still pretty good, but I just don't do the quest. That's why I did not, up did not upgrade it. <laughs> All right, so that ends my list of the things that I think you should be upgrading with your research points. Now I'm going to get into some battles, hopefully climb up to Challenger and enjoy the rest of this video. All right. All right, our first opponent is found 1811, 1811 trophies crowns i don't know what you call them we're waiting for our opponent to enter the battle here we go placing our yellow we're playing aggressive this guy has the bronze ayala this means this guy not too great but i mean he's probably okay he's probably okay he's still up here i think it's diamond league still yeah so we're still chilling you know these people are after the reset so these people aren't going to be the greatest but they're not going to be the worst for sure i don't know what he's doing here with the ayala i don't know where he's playing maybe he's getting this camp on his on his right, my left, I don't know. Who cares, really? We're just going for our second camp. He also might be goblining, which I'm kind of scared about. So I'm just going to take a quick peek. What's he going here? Oh, my goodness. He's not even goblining. 
I don't even know what this guy's doing. I'm just going to start playing aggressive. He's going for the Sanctum here. He's been maybe watching my videos because that's something I do. I go for this forward Sanctum instead of the back one. All right, we're going to play aggressive here. Oh my gosh, here comes his Ayala. We're going to still get a Sanctum though, right? Oh, here comes his Vikings. We're going to return real quick. Okay, we're going to get as many Troll Singers as possible. We're going to cancel our return. We're going to get his Sanctum down right here. He canceled his return too fast. He's raging up. That's a waste of a spell, mi amigo. All right, his Ayala should fall here. And oh my gosh, the Troll Singers are about to demolish on this guy. We're going to see if he... Oh, he's already... Okay, dude. GG's, GG's, well played, see you in the next one. All right, already opponent found, let's get into it. If you guys are enjoying the video, I just wanna say again, please subscribe, it helps so much. It keeps you notified of all the Castle Burn stuff that's going on. Also leave a like for that YouTube algorithm, it helps people find the channel, it helps people get involved in Castle Burn, you know what I'm, if you know what I'm saying. And all right, we're gonna get into the video here against Spark. It's also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but the mic quality might be a little bit better today. I, uh, <clears throat> I, uh, I have a microphone here now, which is kind of better. Uh, also, I just want to say, I have made a Patreon. So, if you guys would be interested in uh, helping me out at all in regards to uh, creating content, uh, supporting me in my college adventures. Oh my goodness. <sighs> college is kind of tough, guys. College is kind of tough. I uh, play D1 Athletics as well. And yeah, it's just a tough time, dude. It's just a tough time. This guy's going for his next camp over here on his left side i'm gonna go for my tier actually because i feel like that's how we lose that's how we lose is not getting the tier up and i also want to get my camp down as well but i also want to play aggressive on this level there's so many things i want to do right now i just can't do and oh my goodness today's a, today's been a very wild day i'm kind of tired today oh my goodness i'm sorry guys it's okay we're gonna get the sanctum down we're gonna play aggressive on this left side as well he might be going for the super sanctum but i have learned it's better to play for this left hand sanctum then against the super sanctum uh for one main reason and that main reason is that this side we can place camps in front of our sanctum this side on the on the, my left side his right side you can't really do that it's not the same thing here we're going to place our yellow pretty up close we're going to bring our troll slingers around he just uses ability we're going to be chilling now we're going to get our next sanctum up and going and hopefully we're going to get his sanctum down here Oh, he's getting, oh my gosh, he's getting, dude, what is this man doing? Dude, he's just going to let me take his entire stuff. He's going to take, let me take all of his, all of his things, me amigo. All right. I'm going to next tier two, I'm going to get my hammer, not hammer warriors. I'm going to get riflemen here. And oh my gosh, dude, this, this is insane. This is crazy sauce. He, I don't know what this man's doing. This man is wild. He doesn't even have a sanctum up on that side. And oh my gosh, this is gonna be GG, dude. He doesn't have any. He doesn't have any camps or anything, dude. He's kind of like just. I don't know. He doesn't really have anything going for him. He doesn't have any sanctums. I'm just gonna keep spamming. He might go um, Lupine Berserkers. I could see this man going Lupines, but nah. He's just gonna accept the loss. GG's me amigo. That was a fun time. Let's see that victory screen, if you know what I'm saying. There we go. All right, last thing I'm going to do for you guys is open up these card packs, and then we'll be out of here all fine and dandy. All right, first thing. Oh, my gosh. We have that maximum card reward, so we're going to be getting 198 gold with those juicy amount of fire pillars. Let's see what we get in our second pack. Oh, no, uh, no hero, no rare, but it's okay. We get 15 bonds. I'm hyped with that. We're good. All right, and that is all. Thank you all so much for watching. It really means a lot. It really does. Keep supporting Castleburn. really means a lot. Hope you guys enjoyed the uh, the review. I guess not necessarily review, but you know what I'm saying. The, the go over and over the card packs. This video took a lot of time. So I really would appreciate if you guys, again, hit that like button. I just said like two seconds ago, but help me out with that YouTube algorithm, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.